Welcome to Philosophy in Review. In this episode of our Empiricist Philosopher series, we will discuss the philosophy of John Locke. John Locke, who lived from 1632 to 1704, was an English philosopher and one of the founders of liberal political philosophy. This is the philosophy of individual rights and limited government. It is the philosophical basis for the American Constitution and all Western political systems. Locke's most famous work is his two treatises of government in which he argues that sovereignty resides in the people. Locke's political thought was grounded in the notion of a social contract between citizens. He also advocated for the importance of toleration, especially in matters of religion. He argued that people having certain natural rights, including the right to life, liberty, and property. He also asserted that governments are formed to protect these rights and that they should be based on the consent of the governed. Locke believed that governments should be divided into three separate branches, the legislative, executive, and judicial. This would prevent any one branch from becoming too powerful. Many of Locke's ideas were used in the U.S. Declaration of Independence and the U.S. Constitution. Locke's political ideas are still cited by many people today who believe in limited government and individual rights. Locke believed that education is essential for a free and democratic society. He argued that education should be designed to train people to think for themselves. Locke also made significant contributions to epistemology with his essay concerning human understanding. This was one of the first great defenses of modern empiricism. It concerns itself with determining the limits of human understanding in respect to a wide spectrum of topics. It thus tells us in some detail what one can legitimately claim to know and what one cannot. Locke believed that the mind is a blank slate, a tabula rasa, at birth. He argued that we are not born with any innate ideas, and that all of our knowledge comes from experience. Locke's empiricism was a major departure from the rationalism of earlier philosophers, such as René Descartes and Baruch Spinoza. Rationalists believe that we can arrive at knowledge through reason alone, without the need for experience. Locke, on the other hand, argued that experience is essential for knowledge. Locke's empiricism had a profound impact on the development of modern philosophy. It helped to lay the foundation for the development of modern science, and it continues to be influential today. Here are seven quotes attributed to John Locke. 1. Wherever law ends, tyranny begins. 2. The human understanding is like a blank slate, or a tablet which is smooth, void of all characters, without any ideas. 3. All men are by nature free, equal, and independent, and have certain inherent rights, of which, when they enter into society, they cannot by any compact deprive or divest themselves. 4. Governments are instituted among men, deriving their just powers from the consent of the governed. 5. Toleration is the chief characteristic of true religion. 6. Education is the great engine of social mobility. 7. The mind is not a container, but a processor, of information. Thanks for watching. Please give us a like if you enjoyed this video and feel free to comment to let us know your thoughts on it.